All right, boys and girls, after you create your tour, you are ready to add the introduction information into it. The introduction information is similar to the title of a book or the book cover. It's going to have the title of your tour. It's going to have your name. You can add a picture and you can also give it a summary as well. The tour name and the author name is automatically populated from when you created your tour. So the next thing that you need to do is add a photo. So let's click add a photo. You can add a photo from your Google photo album. You can upload a photo from your device. You can do a Google search image right here from this search bar, or you can paste the image URL right here if you know it. So for this example, I'm going to do a search for images and I'm going to type in social studies and I'm going to click on the first image. I can edit the captions here if I wanted to by giving it a title and description. And if I didn't want this image for my cover page, I can simply click the trash can to delete it. This paragraph text box here is going to allow you to provide a summary for your tour. You can format your information, you can bold it, you can italic, you can underline it, you can provide a link, you can add a bulleted list as well, or a numbered list. The type of story is defaulted to Story 3D. You can change that if you would like, but I recommend that you leave it to 3D. You can change your path color. The default is yellow. Uh, if you'd like to change it, you may pick a different color. And once you're done adding all that introduction information in, you are ready to move on to add a location.